Hey guys, and welcome back to Lemonas. When we last left off, we were exploring this cathedral, and I think it's just about time to go and collect the final piece. But what do we need? Uh, we actually need some of that stuff that I'm putting back. We need the shotgun shells, we need the shotgun. Ah, uh, and we need the plaque piece. Yes, we do. Right, let's go. Now, because I've already completed the game, even though uh, I've literally only just done that, uh, the game glitched out and we completed it previously, I actually unlocked the Western costume. Which, well, why not? Let's show it off. It kind of looks like something out of Bloodborne, not going to lie. I actually quite like this. So, I keep wanting to go through there for the po uh, portal, but of course, there is no portal. Okay, now we've actually got uh, a pretty rough part of the game coming up, to be honest. We're going to grab that, and we're going to equip the shotgun, and we're going to go for a little walk just over yonder. Now, we have that, but the door is locked, requires a small key. We don't have a small key, but we do have another key, which we are going to exercise right now. I do love this area. I also thought this cathedral area was going to be a lot bigger and a lot longer than it actually is, but pleasantly surprised. Now I'm glad this game is coming to a close, because as much as I've enjoyed it, well, there is another game on the horizon. You know what that is. I know what it is. And I, for one, cannot wait. Right, so we've got the handgun bullets. Um, hmm. I guess we could do some chip damage with these guys. Just see if we can't dump out some of this handgun ammo. If we can take these guys on one at a time, that would be rather wonderful. Because there is a lot of enemies here. And if I can take at least one or two of them out with a handgun one down I'd be a happy chap oh second guy now is he alone he's not alone by the look of things no he's not that was a silly time to oh god we are right up against the wall here oh we're stuck on him that's not good that's not good at all. Oh, are we empty? We are. Let's swap that magazine over. In truth, we probably don't have to be that careful with our ammo. Because we're basically at the end of the game now. At least... We're at the end of the game if we want the standard ending. Or should I say the standard good ending. And I'd need to turn this down because it's deafening. There we go. Okay. Alright, happy with that. I actually got two of them down with a handgun. Happy. Happy days. Who's next? Because we're not done yet. Oh no. We are not done yet. Oh, run, Alicia. Alicia's not very good at running. Bless her. Let's eat that med kit. Come on then, you. Let's be having yet. There you go. You don't like that, do you? I've just noticed the shotgun shells, 
They're actually yellow, aren't they? Yeah, and they're yellow in that picture, which is pretty interesting. But we've still got more enemies in here. Luckily, they're these long-range guys. So we're not going to worry too much about them. But we're going to take them down all the same. Even though, to be honest with you, it seems a little bit pointless. Okay, there should be one more. Yeah, he's over that side. Right, let us bring swift justice to the lad. Now these guys seem a little bit inconsistent Oof, with the amount of damage they take. See, he took four shots because the first, uh, well, I think it's the second show, I actually missed him. Uh, but the other guy took six shots and they all hit him. A little bit odd, but whatever. See, there's an axe there. He's bleeding out like a good boy. I'm going to take the magazine just because. Seems uh, no reason to leave it for the roaches. Got a nice med kit there, or at least health pack. More shotgun shells, beautiful. All right. Not bad. So. Ah, I didn't notice that we could go up here. I haven't looked up here. How curious. Ooh, hello. More shotgun shelves. Yes, please. Jammed. Okay. I had no idea we could come up here. I wonder what else is up here. Because there's another little way to go here. Ooh. Is there any notes or anything that I've missed? This area is really pretty. Ah, look at that. A door. Ooh. Folks, we're in uncharted territory here. Ooh, looks like we've got some more cultists. That's okay. Let's see if we can't do at least the majority of the damage with the handgun. Oh, he's, he, he's, this guy's pretty active. He got one pistol round left. <laughs> he didn't care. That's fine. Oof, you little git. Mm, quite enough of that, sir. Okay. So what is along this hallway? When I played this, I can't believe I missed this area. How curious. That's what you get for not reading the guide, I guess. Hey, I unlocked it. Does this lead to where I think it's going to lead? Oh, it actually does. Very nice. I didn't think we'd be able to open that door. All right, so what's down the other little alleyway? I'm assuming we can get a note or something. Surely. Ooh. Just this mad lad here. That's fine. We've got more than enough ammo to take his ass out. Now, now, now. That's another save disc. I mean, sure, I guess. Why not? Ooh. What is this? Bowgun? Ammo? I mean, sure, I suppose. This looks like some sort of uh, guest quarter. Not guest quarters. Um, I guess for the inner sanctum? Maybe? Although this place looks like it's been pretty ransacked. Somebody's built some sort of pillow fort in there. I, I understand. Seems cosy. Can't go in there. Oh. Ooh. Hello. Okay. Ooh. There's a zombie. Didn't expect to see a zombie in there. <gasps> Ooh. What could that possibly be a key to? 
Well, there is one door that I didn't manage to get into. Let's leave the handgun. Is that an old key? Interesting. We're discovering this together, guys. I guess we can't do nothing with that one. All right, what we've got left in the shotgun? 27 shells. That's fine. That's plenty. The actual final boss in this game is a huge letdown. I'm going to be honest. I was expecting some kind of grand, epic fight. Uh, <laughs> yeah, not really. And not really at all, if I'm being honest. But that's all right. That's fine. Now, I'm guessing this is for this door. It is. So what the hell is through here? Ooh, another zombie. Two, lots of zombies. Feels like a humongous waste to use that on these guys. But that's all we have at the moment. Shells. I mean, okay. Wasn't a total waste then, I suppose. Ah, a note. Except from the journal of Dr. Arnold Howard. I have managed to configure a rough translating mechanism using the mechanical tool to sort through the symbols and match their appropriate meeting, uh, meetings. It took several days of trial and error to get this contraption to give me sensical sentences, but now my lexicon of words to symbols is growing thanks to the impressive collection of linguistic texts found at the library, which I have used to formulate a rough language. I have met this new development with excitement and apprehension, as the first few lines of script I have deciphered come out sounding like the rantings of a man in a fever dream. The Albert Ruff, or Albert Ruff translation I've gathered so far comes as, blood must be corrupted, must carry, special, which, well, uh, which will help us ascend upon us in, a, in the crimson gaze of the blood moon. Ha. Huh. I mean, they're certainly words. And I guess, okay, I thought I might find his lexicon or something. Strange device. Strange indeed. Oh, that's a rather nice item. Let's grab that. Okay, I guess that's all that's there. Alicia checks the device one more time. Looks like this invention, invention can read words and numbers. Oh, do you want to decode your files? Yes. So now, I believe if we go to our files, uh, which files, though, have been deciphered? Do we have to scroll through all of them? Uh, Divine Fire Note. Old Alfred has instructed me to unlock the gate. Leading to the swamp. Uh, I think we've read that one. Worker diary. Unknown source diary. Ah. I am certain of it. She is the one. She is the one they speak of in the tomes. The blessed one. Those are rare beings found once in a century. She has all the signs. Manifesting five points stigmata. Changing iris colours. Abnormal body temperature. Convulsions at the sight of pagan script. And other religious blasphemes uh, every day that passes by I can feel myself growing weaker my followers look upon me with such faith such confidence if only they'd seen me all those years ago back in my prime when I was young robust I have the girl now however she will be instrumental in opening the gates and once the gates are open she has taken well to the initiation. Her receptiveness to the chaos magic rituals proves my theory that she can, by her will alone, open the gates. I must be careful, though. If she were to ever learn the true extent of her power, she may get it in her head to defy her master. This must not happen. She must remain subservient. 
She goes, uh, she grows stronger every day. It's incredible, really, how much she has evolved since we abducted, abducted her. It is becoming harder, however, to keep her from exploring her own abilities. She must never find out how powerful she truly is. I have managed to keep her subdued with a spell when we are not practicing and preparing for the big ceremony. But even these are wearing off. As the eclipse draws closer, it is becoming harder to keep her controlled. Soon, everything will be happening very fast. The day is approaching. The stars will soon be in alignment. We must make sure this goes off without incident. Although my many connections in the outside world, or through my many connections in the outside world, I have learned the fate of the girl's mother. She must be taken care of, for she knows too much. I suspect, uh, suspects too much. The woman is due for a transfer to another one of those hellish prisons, the root of which just so happens to take her within my jurisdiction of power. It's all coming together. I can easily make it look like an accident, clean up all the loose ends. The girl won't have to know. She's growing more powerful each day. Her perce uh, perception is growing stronger. But I have my ways of hiding things from her. How interesting. Okay. So... Uh, I will go through a lot of these. Um, is that all of them? I think that's all of the stuff that needs to be translated. Okay, well, let's go back to the save room because we now need to equip ourselves and ready ourselves for combat I do like the way that door loops right round. I can't believe I missed that <laughs> when I, I've just played this section um, you know to prepare for what's to come and well I'm a dumbass but then you already know that so we need to put that back put that back my god, we have so many freaking save discs. It's kind of insane at this point. Uh, and we did forget to pick up the plaque piece. Because of course we did. Right, we're going to want you. We are going to want uh, a large bandage. And let's get some funky voodoo. We don't really need the shotgun. I'm going to be on it. Nah, do we want the shotgun? Maybe. I guess. Um, let's grab you out. Let's combine these two together. Let's drop you back. And drop you back. Then we are going to pull that through. Um, did we not find a small bandage? Uh, curious. I thought we did. No matter. Right, we're going to take the Mac. And we're going to put that back, I suppose. We will grab that. No, we're going to have to come back here anyway. Yeah, we are. That's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate, because we want the Mac ammo, we want the explosive ammo as well, although... <sighs> but we still need a slot to pick up that thingity what's it. Alright, let's go back a minute, grab that. God damn it. And then what I'm probably going to do is come back and save it, and then we're going to go fight the final boss. Now, there is a secret hidden ending, uh, which is the best ending in the game. Uh, but that involves some some stuff, should we say. So I think in the next video, we're just going to... It's probably going to be a short one. We're just going to fight the main boss and show off the good ending. Because that's the ending that we're heading for. We're heading for the good ending. But there's like a good plus ending. Ah, can't believe I forgot that bloody plaque. In fact, there's even a quicker way back. Nah, actually, thinking about it, because you have to go through all the tunnels and stuff, it probably wasn't that much quicker, in all fairness. Ooh, yet another save disc. Yeah, see, I'm sure 
There is also a small bandage in here somewhere. Ah, what are you? Handgun magazine. You know what? We don't care. We don't care about it. The handgun at this point is just so obsolete. It, it, it's pointless. So, if I was a small bandage, where would I be hiding? Hmm. You know, there isn't actually that many small bandages in this game. There's more medium bandages than anything else. You would have thought that that would have been the reverse. Because that one is open, which is curious, because the other side, which looks like it might open at some point, maybe, is actually locked. But there is more to find in this cathedral. I know that much. Because from what I can understand, the hidden ending is actually really quite hidden. All right, let's grab you. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Let's drop you. Drop. Grab you. Combine. I suppose we'll take the save disc just for shits and gigs. Um, and then we will go back up here. Go the scenic route, go back to the save room, save it, and then we're ready. We're ready to cure this place's blight once and for all. And I forget which way we're supposed to be going. Because of course I do. And I can also check my notes and see what needs to be read. Because I'm pretty sure... I don't want to say for certain, but I'm pretty sure I have got all of the notes. But I would have thought if I did, we would have popped an Achievo for that. There's probably some tricky little shitty... Ah, no. We couldn't have got all the notes yet. Because, yeah. Yep. Okay. That's fine. We must be close, though. We must be very close. frighteningly close. I'm sort of tempted to just go and fight the boss, but yeah, I just don't have time for it today. Uh, right, let's... We could have used that, I suppose. When we come back, I would have used that. That would be in the elevator, because you slot that into the elevator. And you know what, actually? Scratch that. Uh, would be nice to have the Mac ammo. I guess. Hmm. To take the shotgun. See, I do like the explosive ammo here. These explosive bolts. However, um, because these explosive bolts plus the Mac absolutely annihilated the enemy, the the final boss. Like it, it, it was actually really kind of sad. It was pathetic. And I guess we could take the Mac ammo. Because let's have a look. Yeah, I think that would be fine. And then we'll use a vinyl to save the game. So I'm going to save it here, guys. When we come back, I'm going to lead you all to war. And complete victory over this menace. Or at least a victory of sorts. We'll get the complete victory a little bit later on. So thank you very much for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.